Hello everyone, and welcome to my short tutorial on downloading photos from your iPhone, no iCloud required, but you do need access to a machine running Linux. To get started, we first need to connect the phone to the computer via USB and tell the phone to trust the computer. Once that's done, we need to install a couple pieces of software to allow Linux to speak with the iPhone. The program we're going to be installing here is called iFuse. And then here I'm trying to sort of skip a step, as I was under the impression that Ubuntu already came with this package installed, uh, but if it doesn't, then you just need to install the lib mobile device utils. The distro of Linux you are using may already have this software installed. If that is the case, then you're already good to go. Now we just need to use the iFuse software to validate that the USB connection is proper and that the computer can detect the iPhone. Next, we need to create a directory in our Linux file system, wherein we can mount the iPhone's file system. I'm just going to be creating a directory called phone in my home directory. We can then mount the file system of the iPhone in the file system we just created. And we do that with this command. Now we can navigate into the directory where we have the phone's data mounted in and verify that all of the data we want is in fact there. Finally, we have determined that everything is present. We can simply copy all of the files over to another directory on the local file system. After that's done, we can unmount the phone using this command. And that's pretty much it. Using this method, you can get around Apple's weird software locks that prevent you from transferring photos from an iPhone without using more of Apple's proprietary software. If you enjoyed this video or found it helpful, please leave a like and tune in later for more tutorials.